We were at that local Goodwill. Hadn't been here for a little while. Look at this. Three ninety nine. It's got a bunch of cars in it. But this mammoth bag. It's chopped full of cars. I'm guessing it's the same price. I don't see a tag on it. But we're going to keep on looking. Welcome guys to Next Level Toys. As promised in the last short video there. Here is the Goodwill haul that we found. The funny story though. We got there. There was only me in the store. Along with a couple girls in the clothing area. And a guy. As soon as I got over to the toys, this guy came around and there's two hours of toys. I found this one for $3.99. Well, he goes around to the other section. He found two bags of cars too. And he kept following me and even looking at my buggy. So the first time I ever had someone else going through toys whenever I'm hunting. But I think we did get the better ones of the two. Because I did the same thing. I glanced at his. One of them did kind of look like this, a chock full bag. Now, when we was there, they didn't have a tag, and they went back and slapped a $4.99 tag on it. So this was five bucks. But let's see what we got. Let's start off with the $4 bag. We love hunting through these. I don't ever just cheat and look through them all. It makes it more fun to see what we get. We go through stores and Goodwill anywhere else we can find stuff. So if you're new to the channel, we don't need that. Please subscribe. If you like that kind of stuff, we love hunting for toys. Happy Mail Toy most likely. And we, we donate these to local other thrift stores. The one things that we really just don't need. And we love finding action figures and die cast cars. Uh, looks like another Happy Toy. There's a bendable McDonald's, but we're not trying to get into all that. <clears throat> First vehicle is a knockoff little police truck. And there's a one of them robot looking things. A lot of happy little toys are going to be in this probably. Please let us know what you think of this haul. I know it's early, but love to hear from you at the end of the video. Richard Petty Cheerios. We have a couple of these. There's a, ooh, Tony the Tiger. Is this Hot Wheels? No, Racing Champions. I think this one is too. Nope, it says a knockoff. Speaking of knockoff, here's the police jeep to go with that truck with broken windshield. So not really fun on quality here. Made in China rig, just your basic rig. Half a mill toy. There is a um, manufacturer for something. It's a half a toy. Plastic car. It's not even a pull behind. Uh, it's looking like I may have gotten head on this one. Now, this is an unusual uh, SS China. But this is a very heavy, heavy solid metal vehicle it don't even look like a Cadillac escalator or nothing it just it's neat I've never seen anything quite like this it's got a lot of weight so that's where the weight is in this bag power ranger or uh, power puff girls there's a power launcher it ain't hot wheels so uh, you don't see anything on the bottom really Got an egg. This is intended for 14 and over. And uh, some kind of hobgoblin. <clears throat> oh, wait, that's from uh, the Minions. Dr. Drew, whatever his name is. Plastic little red truck. <laughs> it's not, not found in one hot wheel car in this. And this is a half no toy, most likely. Uh, yeah, Burger King. Although that's a pretty nice quality head no toy. Oh, looky here. The tables have turned. Superman is my favorite hero. I didn't even know this was in here. 
this is why we do this this um 2015 look at this figure guys heck yeah that's the word that's worth the three four bucks you got a cape made out of plastic got shorter pads even he's where you hit the gym that's a nice find right there that's at least a couple bucks so we didn't get two hat on this but i'm not seeing anything else there's tinkerbell the wolf um that's happened with toy most likely just a lot of happened with toys that's like mojo jojo but it ain't there's a big donald duck from looney tunes wedged into a that but there's just nothing else these are from the new looney tunes movie so yeah that's it on this bag so we i don't know didn't do too as good as i thought but i'm hoping this next bag will redeem ourselves so those that i missed it it's 4.99 five bucks here this is what the weight is let's just get right into it we have a plastic truck which yeah we'll donate to kids because my son's outgrown it and i don't need it there is a sick a 1955 chevy step side but the wheels are gone so someone took the wheels off I got a green one just like this. The doors will open. There's a large scale bike. <laughs> Handles are gone. That's the bad thing about Goodwill, guys. Uh, but sometimes you can score a uh, 2011 McDonald car. There is a Mustang Camaro, 68 Camaro, my bad. Same issue. Someone has plucked the rubber wheels off of it. If we can find them, we can just slide them back on there. But nice heavy casting. Thomas the Train in rubber. First Hot Wheel car, 19, 2014 Lotus. There we are. We got a first Hot Wheel car. Not too old. But I only got one other than this. So uh, that's good. There's the Hot Wheels fish with the jaws. I thought they opened, but I guess they do not. But there is that. There's a finger puppet. Here's the Hot Wheels, but it's been drastically crashed. Uh, we might be able to fix those axles but other than that it looks like it's nice shape 2014 no vintage ones hopefully there is there is a action race car the details on this is very nice so uh, if we collect these nice cars i won't overpay on them because there are a lot of them out there there is a little rubber plastic thing here not really into that this is a matchbox 2013 whiplash it fooled me for a second there thought it was a hot wheels it is indeed a matchbox because it has that little matchbox logo on there so the only way i can really tell a couple little knicker knackers <clears throat> A Willie's. It looks old, but it really ain't. And it's been plucked over. It could be vintage, but it's just really bad shape. It's even missing the grill. Well, would you look at that? We have a full size Chevy truck. Someone had a wheel addiction. They took all the wheels off of these things. So, somewhere there's about 20 rubber wheels. Probably in the trash. We got Paw Patrol. These ain't cheap. So I'm always collecting these now because down the road, Paw Patrol will be the next collectible toy. 
my son loved it and he just now got done outgrowing that 2019 hot wheel mcdonald race car this is an older one 1993 a vintage hot wheels mcdonald happen little toy For those who don't know yes this came from mcdonald's back in the mid 90s what is this Bean? Thomas, this is a Thomas the Train. <laughs> I just should have looked at the front of it. If it has a face like that, you know where that came from. But uh, it has a ladder that's supposed to be there or some kind of something. Maybe like a fire pole truck. Somebody's casting, but yeah, pretty sure it is missing something there. Yeah, Hot Wheels. Where it's dirty and everything, it looks old, but we know this casting is actually still in the stores. So I might go grab one still. This looks like a Infinity Matchbox. We don't really find many of these Infinities. In fact, this is very rare. For, you know, we don't have too many of these at all. Got a little sunroof. Cute little coop. A uh, little pullback toy. There's another proper toy puppet. Another one of these. We're not trying to get into that. And there's a Pacifica. It looks like Hot Wheels 2018. Nice little vehicle. There's a police car. We'll be donating that for sure. Here's a Hot Wheels racer. La la la. Just in time for Christmas. There's another, uh, there's a dog finger puppet. Half of a tracker. We'll probably keep the trackers if there's any more. Oh, here's another. A lot of this stuff is just in missing pieces though. Then we got a plastic gasoline truck. Interesting. A pig. Ooh, we got the cars. Dino Co car. I collect these. So uh, that's a nice fan. And there's a Bigfoot knockoff here. It is metal. Here's an aftermarket car. But I'm not seeing much else here. There's a little another dozer. And uh, that's going to do it for this. Just a couple little finger puppets. Please let us know what you think on today's haul. Not as exciting as I thought it would be, but we did find a couple of cool things. Till then, uh, thank you for watching Next Level Toys. Until then, happy hunting out there, and we shall see y'all next time. Goodbye.